The worries over water, stronger in some communities than in others. Across Arizona, the Gila River Indian community growing more concerned that the waterway of the same name will run out as their county grows at an incredible rate. For generations, the Gila River ran mostly under the Indian community. Today, along one of the small stretches of desert, it reflects the sun. It serves as the site of a newly built aquifer recharge system, which allows the community to capture groundwater, store it for later use, and lessen their reliance on the Colorado River. This tripled the size of our storage capacity here and allowed us to be a significant contributor to the DCP process. Over the last seven years, Pinal became the fastest growing county in Arizona, its population increasing almost 15%. Communities like Casa Grande rely mainly on groundwater. The Department of Water Resources now telling developers they can't rely on that anymore. Right now, our water comes from drilling the aquifers. There is a sufficient supply right now, but looking long range, there's not a sufficient supply for 100 years. Jim Robinette has been selling real estate in Pinal County for 30 years. He says a lot of people worry about water. There's been 15 projects that have been notified by letter that their model does not support a 100 year water supply. The demand for groundwater in Pinal will increase because farmers who lost their allocation of cap water can now drill new wells. Without a guaranteed 100 year supply of water, an estimated 139,000 new homes risk not getting built. When asked Friday if farming and development can coexist in Pinal County, Governor Ducey remained hopeful. There will always be more to do on water in Arizona. In the past, growing cities like Maricopa have worked out deals to purchase water from elsewhere. Jim Robinette says that is one possibility for developers, but with the effects of the drought so far reaching, he admits finding a seller may not be so easy.